19 years ago, mass shootings just didn't happen very often, certainly not here. But tomorrow marks 19 years since the Columbine shooting, which changed everything. And tonight, survivors of Columbine are teaming up with survivors of February school shooting in Florida, kicking off a nationwide vote for our lives effort. And the goal here is gun control. And Denver 7's Jackie Cray is live from tonight's rally. And Jackie, you spoke to those young people earlier today. Yeah, we spent some time with them. This rally actually just started. You know, we've seen the school walkouts across the country. We've seen the March for Our Lives events, too. And now this rally is Vote for Our Lives just getting underway behind me. It's to encourage young people to register and vote, all in an effort to bring attention to gun violence and to honor those we have lost. Now, this morning, students from Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School met and bonded with Colorado students who have in some way themselves grown up affected by the tragedy at Columbine High School. Even until recently that I realized that my story isn't normal, that this doesn't happen to most people, but it happens way too often. It should have stopped with Columbine. Like that was, that should have been the breaking point. And back out here live tomorrow is a scheduled national student walkout and Columbine High School will actually instead continue its tradition as it does every 420 and make it a day of service. We're live at the Vote for Our Lives rally. Jackie Craya, Denver 7. Thank you.